some of us have spent years making machine learning models and have hoped someone will use them. We're going to show you a fascinating service desk AI system from a guest AI chef on the Cozy AI Kitchen. Working with multiple models, integrating the latest GPT models, we are in luck because we have Chef Kobashi from Fujitsu to teach us how to make the best work with this kind of complex architecture. Welcome, Chef Kobashi. Hi, thank you very much for inviting me us here. Uh, my name is Hiro, yeah, Fujitsu Research. Well, you're like a master chef. You'd like earn this at Build, so this is oh, going to be yes. easy. That's right. Yeah, I got this great apron at the Microsoft Build in this May. How long have you been using GPT models? Um, actually, I'm using it uh, two years now. Two years yes, is actually. like 20 years, <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. Right. It actually, the emerging, at the emergence of the GPT, we have started already because we are so excited about the power of the AI. Yeah. Well, at the frontier with frontier models. Well. I know you have a special recipe for working with AI yes. and machine learning models. Yeah. Could you walk us through that recipe? Of course. So um, this is the Fujitsu's uh, AI recipe by utilizing the, the generative AIs, and we call it as the composite AI. So let me explain about it a little bit with the uh, slide now. So composite AI, there's the interface, it's a kind of dashboard, and there's the chat face in his, and you can put anything what you want to do it. And once you put it, the request come to the Composite AI. And then Composite AI will utilize the AI powers which is stored inside of the Composite AIs. And if I go through the more detail in here, so this is the secret recipe of the Composite With AI. With semantic kernel. Of course, why not? <laughs> why not? Semantic kernel is the core of the Composite AI now. So let's, let's, uh, let me explain that a little bit more detail. So uh, you can follow the numbers, okay? Uh, first, you need to request to the Composite AI. And there's the Composite AI core is here, and core will ask the semantic kernel to create a plan based on the your request. And once the plan has been made it, so now it's a time to compose the AIs. And we have, again, a bunch of the AI technology inside of Composite AI. And in this case, so we have utilized the AutoML for machine learning creations, Opto AI for optimization, and the visualizations is for the visualized. Wow, it's a whole, it's a, it's a full recipe. Yeah, whole recipe is here. And also the, the, these tasks, as you can see in here, this here will be assigned to the agent. Yeah, oh, easy. Function calling? Yes, of course. Oh my gosh, chef, ah, this is incredible. Yes. And the task agent will utilize the, any kinds of technologies in the Composite AI and create the an answer for you based on your request. Well, Chef Kobashi, I know you've already made the meal with your recipe. Do you mind showing the viewers your finished meal with oh, plating? Yeah, of course, we will show it. <laughs> so as you can see, there is the several data sources in here like a service now SAP and Fujitsu as well. And also there are so many AI technologies in the composite AI already. So you don't need to understand these technologies because composite AI knows about it. Mm. So in this case, it is about our use cases. It is about uh, service desk uh, task assignment technologies. So you know, there are so many uh, incidents can be happened in the service desk and the service manager is always thinking how to assign the property the task to They're the They're so proper. stressed out. That's right, of course. Mm. We needed to make it very efficient, so we must be fair. So how can I do that? It's the, one of the biggest delicious. problems in here. This looks delicious. Thank you very much. And now, yeah, my composite AI is try to understand what I want to do it. So actually, I am asking him to create a good plan to execute the uh, task assignment. Exactly. And the, like uh, we say, there's the five uh, workers today, and there's the 20 incident in here. And this, for example, I need a rest in uh, lunchtime or something. Such kind of restriction also you can provide. And once pass it, so this composite AI, yes will wow. give us the answer. So in this case, this guy, uh, this composite AI think, okay, let's utilize data lake from, from data as data source, AutoML and digital running for optimization. But of course you can change if you want, just say so. So in, and then in this case, the last one can be changed. So everything will, via, uh, will be done by via the chat. So you don't need to program it. So 
This is, this is the agent. Wow, it's amazing how you took a lot of work, spending years building the machine learning models, yes. using GPT with function calling, and you've wrapped it in such a beautiful demo. That's right, and also this is the result. So in oh this result, uh, we load the data from service now, yeah. predict it, uh -huh. and optimize it. So it is uh, pretty much everything we do. So predict and optimize. That's right, it's a two steps in here. So I see. This kind of the two-step um, machine learning AI uh, utilization was for just only for expert. Mm. But now we have a Gen AI. Mm. Gen AI will help you to be an expert. Mm. Even you are not, no, you are not. Well, Chef Kobashi, as clearly a master chef, two years of GPT experience Thank you very under much. your belt. Do you have any advice for different developers out there hoping to make a difference in this AI revolution? Right. Uh, actually, GPT-4 is or, or other Gen AI is quite powerful. Uh, you may utilize that technology for the translation or summarization in the daytime, but it's just one aspect, it's just a small aspect, aspect of the Gen AIs. This kind of the uh, function calling or agent usage is the next stage. So please remember it and also please focus on to yeah, utilize these function in your life. Well, there you have it. You have multiple models. We have agents and function calling all plated in a beautiful way. Chef Kobashi, thank you very much. And to you all out there, follow Chef Kobashi's work. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Bye.